the electronic visitor records keeping system for preventing the spread of COVID-19 in a more reliable way. Here's how the system works. What do users of facilities using the KeePass system need to prepare? Users can use Neighbor, Pass, or KakaoTalk apps to generate QR codes. First, let's go over how to generate a QR code using Neighbor. First, go to Neighbor.com on your smartphone and touch the My Profile icon in the top right-hand corner. Tap the QR check-in icon and then read and agree to the privacy policy. After that, verify your phone number to be issued a QR code to track your visit. The QR code is for one-time use and only valid for 15 seconds to prevent misuse. After 15 seconds have passed, you can generate a new QR code by pressing the retry button. Now, let's go over how to use the Pass app to generate a QR code. First, launch the Pass app and log in by entering your password. Tap the QR Pass button and agree to the terms and conditions to have a QR code generated. Lastly, let's go over how to generate a QR code using KakaoTalk. First, open the KakaoTalk app. Press the Pound button, which is the third button at the bottom. Then, press the COVID-19 button, which is the first button at the top. You can use the QR code check-in function. So, what should facility managers prepare? First of all, download the KeePass mobile app. When you open the app for the first time, click the Business Owner Sign Up button to register. When registering, you must enter the company name business registration number, representative's name, phone number, and facility address. Next, please submit a photo of your business registration certificate. You can take a new photo or use one taken previously. Now, confirm your identity via text message and set an ID and password after confirming your information. Now you can simply and easily use the KeePass system. Before entering the facility, users go to neighbor.com to generate a QR code. The facility manager can run the KeePass app and scan the QR code. One more time. QR code, scan, enter. These are the three key pass steps. Please make sure you remember them. Now, let's take a look at some of the misconceptions and truths surrounding key pass. Personal information collected via key pass is never used for any other purposes than epidemiological investigation. Since the QR code issuing company stores personal information and the Korea Social Security Intelligence Service encrypts the information before storage and distribution, it is impossible to know who is visited where and when. And the collected information is automatically destroyed after four weeks. No additional equipment or devices are required to use the KeePass system. After downloading the app to your smartphone and signing up, it's easy to use the KeePass system. It's also possible to use a smartphone without a SIM card when connected to Wi-Fi. It's possible to register the responsible managers and several employees. After logging in using the business manager ID, Click the Register Employee button and enter the information of the employee who will use the system to enable that employee to also scan QR codes. We are keeping people safe from COVID-19 with the safe and accurate KeePass system. Ministry of Health and Welfare.